The Harlequin is so peaceful that nobody wants to mess with it. Hey everybody, Lake Fusion Aquariums here today, and I wanted to redo one of my older videos on the Harlequin Rasbora. So I'm just going to be going over the Harlequin Rasbora again. I don't think a lot of people watch the Harlequin Rasbora video, but I wanted to go over it anyway just to kind of add a little bit more detail and show why this fish is so awesome. So the Harlequin Rasbora is one of the most robust, like unstoppable, bulletproof fish that I've ever seen personally, and I know a lot of people agree with that it's such an awesome fish so many people use this to start out in their aquarium like to be that first fish in the aquarium to get everything going for said aquarium and it just can survive through a variety of different things whether it be temperature changes or a sudden you know spike of ammonia or whatnot this fish usually will make it through that this guy is not gonna quit early on like some other fish might and another reason why this thing is so awesome, this beautiful fish, is it's beautiful. It's one of the best schoolers I've seen. If you're looking for a schooling fish in your aquarium or in your community aquarium and you want a new fish in there, this guy shoals up with his own brothers and sisters and he just does an amazing job looking nice and swimming around with each other as a unit. Another awesome thing about these fish is that they will eat pretty much whatever food you put in the tank whether it be blood worms uh, flake food bug bites pellets anything you put in there that's big enough to go in their mouth they're going to go for it these fish will feed off of anything they can find in the tank when it comes to microorganisms if there's no uh if it's not your feeding night or anything like that if they're just hungry they're going to eat like micro stuff that they find the behavior of these guys is super fun too they don't bother anybody if anything you're going to be seeing these guys get bullied in your aquarium they're not going to bother anybody i don't think anybody even messes with them in my aquarium and i have some aggressive more aggressive tetras um like t uh, the head and tail light tetras that kind of have that show of force piranha style behavior and they don't even go after the harlequins like the harlequin is so peaceful that nobody wants to mess with it for tank baits for this beautiful fish is pretty much anything that you can think of that's not going to eat it or that um yeah pretty much that nothing's going to eat it like obviously don't keep it with big cichlids don't keep it with cichlids at all unless it's a ram or a micro cichlid of some sort but still be careful these guys are going to get along with pretty much everybody like i said i mean um he's going to be the victim if anything happens in the aquarium water parameters for these awesome fish are going to be very standard you know 7.0 6.5 they can handle those fluctuations though, like I said, like if you're trying to adjust your pH, these guys are not going to give up on you. Uh, they're going to live through the whole thing. I mean, I've even read about some of them getting away in 8.0 pH. I wouldn't recommend that for anybody, but these guys have been shown to live through a fluctuation like that. Like let's say you had lava rock in your aquarium that jets up your pH. These guys are going to be pretty much unfazed. So an awesome fish, super easy to keep. Like I said, a lot of people choose this as their beginner fish. And I've been in the hobby for like over 10 years and I'm just getting into these guys right now and it's one of my favorite fish. So this fish is kind of for everybody in my own opinion and I hope, uh, I know a lot of other people out there agree. It's just an awesome fish. Sweet personality, sweet schooling behavior. These guys are going to live for around, you know, a really long time. These guys can get up to like 7 years, like 5 to 10 years I've heard. So that's pretty awesome and they get around two inches. So even if you have a larger aquarium, a large school of larger Harlequin Rasboras is gonna look pretty sweet in there. So definitely consider these fish. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching.